for your TSI? How will you inoculate your TSI? You inoculate your butt. You stab twice, reaching to the bottom of the tube. So stab twice. Okay, you get your inoculum and then you stab twice. Then you do streaking on the slab. Okay. So if you find it difficult to streak the slab, holding the test tube upright, then you slab it and do like that. Okay? Find it difficult to streak doing this, doing it this way. And hold it in a slanted position and then you streak. Okay? Like that. It, it will be easier for you, depending on which is easier for you. Okay? So stab twice all the way down to the bottom and streak once. What do you want Insert me more. LIA, mamiya, you have. Do you have LIA? Okay. So for LIA, same, same thing. Stab the butt twice all the way down, and then straight the slant once. Same thing. Be sure that when you stab, you have the organism in your needle. Do not stab with a sterile needle. You get your organism, you stab, get the organism only once, stab, streak. Okay? You stab twice, then streak. Okay, like that. And then you streak. Okay? That's how you do it. Mm -hmm. okay, uh, mm -hmm. Do you have the SIM media? <coughs> okay, for the SIM, you stab the media once all the way to the bottom of the tube. Okay? Get your organism. Okay, and then you stab once. So for SIM, once only. Okay? Stop only. Once only. Kill once. Okay. So, what is our organism? E. coli and cloacin. So, that's what we're going to do today. All inoculation. Okay? So we de we'll deal with the results tomorrow, what you're going to do after incubation. So, so you will not be confused. For now, all inoculation, then incubate. Then tomorrow, we'll discuss again what we are going to do. Okay? <laughs> Because if you have two organisms in one tube, how will you know differentiate? You have you have erratic uh, results. Okay, so mommy, I will you give two organisms to each group? So two sets of biochemical tests for each group. So you do the invic. TSI, LIA, simon citrate, and SIM for Enterobacter, and you do the same for E. coli. Don't forget the label. Uh, check your tubes if you have they have the uh, correct label. For example, in Delta, Shepton, and Damit, so just label of Asam E. coli as a Enterobacter. Oh, so you will know how to read your result. Okay, so when you do TSI, label Enterobacter and label E. coli. Okay, let's go to the lab. Get your material.